Hello, my fellow dweebs, and welcome back to another Star vs. the Forces of Evil reaction. We are about to start watching Season 1, Episodes 8, A, and B, which are called Blood Moon Ball and Fortune Cookies. Hey, Star. I'm here to take you to the Blood Moon Ball. Take your so carriage, and a fire, and a right dead now. horse, and go back to the underworld. Wait, I'm dead? Oh, come on, Starship. It's the Blood Moon Ball. Hang on. I'm a changed man, okay? I've got a life coach, Brian. Hey. He's awesome. A happy bunny. <laughs> and, and I have been anger-free for 53 days. 53? Oh! <gasps> Back off, Damon! Marco! Oh, this is about to get so interesting. <gasps> Walk it out and talk. Walk it out and talk. <laughs> Walk it out. Everything is whew, under control. Marco, don't karate him. This is Tom. What is he doing here? He wants to take me to the Blood Moon Ball. Star, never go with a predator to a second location. Look, I can see you're mad. <laughs> you think I'm a total jerk. I get it. But I have changed. If you decide you want to go, just toll this bell. I'm so into it. You're making a big mistake, Star. Maybe I should go with you. Marco, you weren't invited. Besides, you gotta trust me to do the right thing for my... <laughs> Are you okay? Oh, so yeah, cute. totally, totally, totally. Guys like Tom never change. Well, there's only one way for me to find out. You look amazing. Thanks, Marco. Yes, Don't go. I'm only <laughs> going. <laughs> Goodbye, Marco. See you after the blood moon. I want to keep things low key for Star. You want to turn the Blood Moon Ball into a greeting card holiday? Go ahead. Wait, which one of you said that? Me. No, okay. Whoever <laughs> was just talking, raise your hand. You can be positive that your anger is negative. <laughs> Same, Marco. I'll have my own Blood Moon Ball and start the program. <laughs> I love this episode. <laughs> I'm so excited <laughs> to cover so the with you. Here he comes again. Hello, Henry. His name is Henry. <laughs> you must be Tom State. I bet you think that, like, your soul and, like, her soul are totally gonna. Mm? What is. Mm? Turn your head skyward. When the light of the blood moon grovels down and selects two lucky souls, binding them together for eternity in its hypnotic ruby brodom. Whoa. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. Okay. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Star. It's me, Marco. <gasps> Marco? What are you doing here? Let's get out of here. This place is the worst. Oh. That dance was meant for me. Walk it out. No, right. <laughs> Let's go, Marco. So infuriating. I hate to say it, but I warned you about Tom. No, you! You're infuriating! Me? I was just trying to help. You don't trust me to do things by myself. I don't need a hero. I need a friend. Oh. It was a 
wasn't a total disaster. Now I know you can dance. <laughs> Hat, Hat hair. hair. Whoa! Whoa we, we both, both said, said the, the same, same thing. thing. Okay, okay, stop, stop that. that. <laughs> 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 you guys have like 200 pounds on her. <laughs> At least hit her with the rock or something. <laughs> <laughs> After a victory like this, there's only one thing to do. Get Chinese food! You know, we need to commission Tom Whoa, or something. Chinese cause... food! I have no idea You're what that is. just a mess. <laughs> You're always screwing up my brilliant plan! I need someone who can wrangle you imbeciles. Oh, go get change! Delicious! These are fortune cookies. They can magically predict the future. Huh? No way! A friend <laughs> will greet you with a smile. Oh, how sweet! <gasps> See? <laughs> the cookies know all. <laughs> More cookies! They're stale. Gimme! You're a weird girl. Wow, <laughs> Star. Good luck did come your way. It did, it did. These are incredible. <laughs> Previous job experience. Nope. No one's ever been dumb enough to hire me. Weaknesses? I don't have any. <laughs> How am I under pressure? You make absolutely no sense. Go away. Soft. So soft. Next! Next! <laughs> Next! Next! West Munion Swamp Water. Or do you drink from the bottle? Oh. On days like this. Tell me about it. Oh, I'm so <laughs> I've been trying to steal a wand. Where did you come from? I let myself in. When? After you hired me. I hired He's you? He's spooky. Excellent. Hire Excellent. We'll start tomorrow. Powerful cookies, bestow your sugary prophecies upon me. Uh, gotcha, Star. Those fortunes <laughs> aren't magic. Always making nachos. They're put there by people in a factory. Next, you'll tell me that's how they get the snow and snow gloves. <laughs> it's clearly the work of Dark Wizards. Okay, Toffee, I'm going to show you what we're working with here. This is my house. This is my house. This is my my house. This is my house. This is my this is my this is my house. This is my house. This is my my Maybe we can do something with those fortune cookies. What is it? What? You sure you trust him, boss? Of course! On Munit, there's a place where you can get calzones that'll tell you how you're gonna die. You will die <laughs> from choking on a calzone. Just kidding. <laughs> the giant's gonna sit on your face. <laughs> well done. Love is always the answer. It's not the will of the cookie. <laughs> really? Now? No star! <laughs> I want our relationship to have a foundation of honesty. Me too! So confused. Fortune cookies aren't real. There's all the traps a little could steal your wand. Love is never the answer. Oh man, I wanted to say it. <laughs> Mega Mushroom Destruction Blast! <laughs> That guy's freaking me out. They're not real fortunes, but they're still real cookies. A great evil has been unleashed. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I believe that. You're not the first monster to fall victim to their magic. Things will be different when I get the wand. <laughs> We finally got to meet Tom! <laughs> and I couldn't have asked for a more perfect episode to introduce his character. I can totally see how Tom and Star used to date. I think Tom brings out Star's wild side, which is why it's hard for Marco, the safe kid, to bring her back down to Earth. Literally. And I am loving this element of jealousy between Marco and Tom. And my inner Starco fangirl was screaming at the end of that episode. I just 
yeah, it's my favorite one so far because it's super romantic. Now in fortune cookies, I am officially nervous for Star. Ludo and his monsters have always been this kind of funny, non-threatening bunch, but now with Toffee in the picture, I can see the episodes getting more serious from here on out, which I am actually really excited for. Toffee legitimately freaks me out. There's something about a quiet and composed villain that is so much scarier than a loud and talkative one. And Toffee said something at the end of the episode about how it's not the first time that he's fallen victim to Star's magic, and he was sort of looking out at the castle in the distance, and it makes me curious what history is going on there. As always, thank you so much for watching, guys. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed, and subscribe to my channel for new reactions every Friday. And if you would like access to full-length reactions, early release to my videos and a whole bunch of other fun stuff, be sure to check out my Patreon page, patreon.com slash alishadweeb. And I will see you dweebs later.